Okay. I think as we've reached the end of another year, it's important to remember everyone who's contributed to what makes Aberdeenshire great. We obviously have a huge number of council staff who, who do tremendous work across Aberdeenshire, but we're also hugely indebted to the volunteers in all of our communities, whether they're working in community councils, heritage groups, amenities groups, scout groups, sports centres. We have a huge number of talented people helping in all of our communities, and those volunteers are the lifeblood of Aberdeenshire. And I, to all of them, I would say a huge thank you. We had the election back in May, and the new administration um, put together a joint manifesto, which we put out to consultation as part of the preparation of a new council plan. And we got a tremendous feedback from uh, people across Aberdeenshire and from groups across Aberdeenshire. And we're now uh, just uh, recently have put that into the new council plan for the next five years. So having, having set the council plan, we now have to take that forward uh, into the action plan for the next five years. The first part of that is setting a budget in February, uh, which will very much inform what we do for the next year. And we cannot do that alone. We have to work with many partners across Aberdeenshire to deliver the services that you have told us are most important to you. I think it's a time when we all reflect on what has been and what may be to come. So I would like to take this opportunity to thank everyone uh, for their efforts over the last year. Wish every single person in Aberdeenshire and further afield a very Merry Christmas and a happy, healthy and prosperous New Year when it arrives.